haven't been to Arizona. Is this supposed to be like a desert? <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah. Are there snakes out there then? 100%. <laughs> there are snakes. Scorpions? Oh, yeah. Tell us a little about your fight camp. It was great. <laughs> Didn't get air. <laughs> we trained bare knuckles, so fighting with blue gloves is easy. How good does that taste? Sad. <laughs> Sad, whatever that is. Uh, I love the city, it's you know it's widespread, it's open. Um, I think I think the I can smell, I always bring it back to food, but I can smell the food when I, when I walk around. Uh, it's always a great temperature. Um, you know, I really do like it down here, it's different than mass. Twenty third snow <laughs> cold and all that, so I think I may stay here a little bit longer after the fight. <laughs> You see that you've been going around looking at different restaurants. What do you have marked for your first restaurant after? This is all you need to think about. Barbecue place that's right up the street. There is a place where they take donuts, right, and they put ice cream in the middle and they make an ice cream sandwich. That's over in Scottsdale. There's like that rotating restaurant that's right across the street too. A couple taco shops. That's the opening meal, and then afterwards we'll find other things to go to. But I, I've been keeping an eye out for the food. Right? A key component of, of every professional athlete athlete's nutritional diet is definitely Rice Krispies because just when you think you can't eat anymore, you have a couple of these, and then that opens up space. Because I think it's because of the air pockets inside of the Rice Krispies. So if you're really serious about you know getting your shit together and being a real athlete, you need Rice Krispies. 50k, please, <laughs> please give me a 50k. <laughs> What is this? Uh, I've never had these, but half bacon, half cheddar, cheese it, and then all that stuff fills. I got some barbecue Fritos, got some apple fruit pies, some Nutty Buddies, donut sticks, Oreos. I have a feeling Bill would be like horrible. How long are you all going to be here for? Still Sunday. Sunday? I'm going to give you this card. I figure you all might be going still somewhere, yeah. and it's good for you all. You want me in the cookie? <laughs> I guess I don't need I want to be here right now. <laughs> 
You did like a turning double leg. I tried to find a crack in here, but I'm very excited to be fighting on the first ESPN card. Um, I think it's great for all the UFC and all the fighters to be on on a wider platform like ESPN, you know, alongside like football and hockey and all those mainstream sports. What's your thoughts on fighting Benito Lopez? I think I'm gonna beat Benito Lopez. Um, I think it's a good stepping stone for, for me. He's uh, undefeated. He's an up and coming from, from a very good school, alpha male. At the end of the day though, I think that my skills are better than his and I think that I'm gonna be able to hit 14 and out. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Interrogation. Yeah. Donut sandwich, Tempe, Arizona. He's like waiting for me to go. <laughs> you can just ask me. <laughs> <laughs>